Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Accountant. Welcome back to the channel. We finally got SBCs on FIFA Ultimate Team that we have been looking for for the past two weeks. That is a UCL showdown SBC. We finally got those yesterday on Saturday. I want to talk about that and of course content that we could see today on Sunday as well because again, it looks like for the past couple of weeks, we've kind of been in a copy paste cycle with some of these TOTS SF SBCs and again, uh, we have some big days upcoming uh, today with the 82 to 88, the icon upgrade, and the 81 double plus upgrade are all expiring at 6 p.m. UK today. So that means we're probably going to get new upgrade SBCs, possibly the icon moments upgrade, just the icon moments. That would be sick. And then probably another repeatable, not a repeatable, but another TOTS pack. Maybe the 92 plus, maybe an 86 plus player pick, maybe another 90 plus TOTS or any TOTS. I think all of, or any of that could come today. So we're going to talk about that and these two new SBCs and just talk about the Champions League in general because holy moly, what a game we had on Saturday uh, with the final, the last of the quarter final set of games with uh, Depay and the Olympic Lyon mad lads going up against Manchester City and coming home with a dub. With a dub. Before the game, I'll be totally honest with you guys. Before the game, I think I put a pre, pre-match pre bet down of City winning 3-1 to one, and it was the exact opposite. Lyon ended up winning 3-1. to one. So this Memphis Depay card is going to go to a 93. Mares is no longer going to get upgraded. I think that's the only road to the final that's affected. By the game today just the memphis to pie which again he does have a tots that is 94 rated so you know not a dead upgrade but something that's maybe not as uh desired as maybe um you know i guess maris had an upgrade as well so or has a tots as well so either way you were getting a road to the final upgraded that already has a higher version but again the first thing i want to talk about is these two sbcs right here we finally got the sbcs and the pack design for the Champions League showdown. We got Forsberg and Bernat because evidently, as they said on the webpage over here, uh, they were going to be doing these Champions League showdowns coming during the final stretch of the competition. So my guess is that since we got Bernat and Forsberg after um, those games were finished a couple days ago, I would not be surprised if we had another uh, Champions League showdown SBC coming out either on Sunday today uh, between Bayern and um, Olympic Lyon. If we had two SBC players from, from those two teams, either today or on Monday. My best bet would be on Monday, actually, because I think these expire on Monday or maybe these expire on Tuesday. But I think very soon, since we have more Champions League games coming up uh, in the next week, I think the Champions League semifinal games, yeah, Tuesday and Wednesday of this upcoming week. So these SBCs, I think, expire either on Tuesday or I think Monday or Tuesday, these expire. No, Tuesday. So that means I would bet that we would get the other set of Champions League showdown SBCs today on Sunday. That's probably going to be most of our content uh, relating to Champions League on Sunday today. Hopefully they upgrade the ones to watches that are deserving of an upgrade. Again, these two cards are kind of nice, right? Forsberg valued at, I think, a 100, like 100,000 coins each. For both of these cards, I think Bernat takes two squads and Forsberg takes one, or maybe I have that backwards. Yeah, Bernat takes one squad, 84 rated, 70 chemistry, and uh, Forsberg takes two, an 82 and an 83. Uh, I kind of want Leipzig to win after seeing this card for FIFA purposes only, right? Imagine a 93 Forsberg getting boosted with a plus three because the winner of these matches, whether it is PSG, whether it is Leipzig, and then whatever comes tomorrow, the winner is going to get a plus three boost. Again, just like the regular Summer Heat Showdown players, these Champions League Showdown players are going to get that same boost, a plus three rating boost on top of that card already. I'm kind of hoping that Leipzig pull off the amazing upset because I can see it now. Right striker is Latan Ibrahimovic. Left striker, team in the season, Timo Werner. Center attack in mid, Emil Forsberg, 96 rated. Uh, uh, Champions League Summer, summer Showdown boosted card right and the basically when the card gets boosted you see that little up arrow right above the 93 rating if you kind of maybe like screenshot and zoom in you could see it or look at the look at the card i guess more close up that up arrow is going to turn highlighted the 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 teal color it's because right now it's faded it'll turn a teal color and be you know colored in when it does get the boost i talked about it today on uh twitter a little bit the only problem with this is the pack or the card design 
I feel like this is one of the laziest card designs I've ever seen because basically all this card design is is it's the UCL rare with a blue very basic border, a light blue, very basic border around the outside. Uh, compare this to the summer showdown cards that we had during summer heat, uh, the boosted versions, right? Like maybe a Vinicius Jr. or um, see if I have any on my bench right here for quick viewing. Uh, I don't think I do. Let me just check the club. Like Vinicius's card, right? Uh, the, you know, the, the flame with the heat at the top, just the summer heat logo looks looks pretty freaking sick so i think they kind of un undersold themselves here with the car design for the champions league showdown because again i like the summer heat car design now the flame at the top is pretty cool um i just wish they would have been able to do more with that it just seems like a lazy kind of car design in my opinion but uh i'm excited at least that we got the burnout and that we got the forsberg today and i would expect to have a player from bayern munich and a player from olympic Lyon. Today on Sunday or possibly on Monday, because again, if it is on Monday, they're going to have to make that a very short time frame for that SBC. So in the next day or two, we're going to have to see that, I would imagine, unless they're just going to do one per week. So maybe they do one for the semifinal and one for the final. I almost feel like they're going to do one for each game. So we will see what happens. Hopefully we get a second set of SBCs coming out today on Sunday. And again, let's talk more about what's going to come out today and how that could impact the market and stuff in this game, right? This icon upgrade, the one that uh, we have had for the past, like what, 20 something days, 28 days maybe, the prime or moments icon player is going away. We are gonna be getting, most likely, in my opinion, the moments only icon pack, right? This was a pack that was added to the code earlier uh, this last week. I think it was on Friday maybe. I'm gonna show you the pack code once again if you guys have not seen it. Um, this is it right here from Footwatch on Twitter contains one icon moments player. Now, if they put this any icon player pack, people are going to get mad. I think that's already been used in objectives. It has been used. I don't think they'll use it again. I think the icon moments, any icon moments player, just, just icon moments, not primes, just the moments pack, I think is going to be dropped into the store today on Sunday. And then, of course, we still have not seen the 89 five rare gold players pack or the 92 TOTS SF guaranteed. So those are still potential coming out today. In my opinion, I think they're going to re-release the 82 to 88 and the 81 plus double upgrades. There is a slight chance that they could put out the 85 to 92 and the 84 double plus upgrades. In that case, if they do that. The 84 double plus upgrades are going to be cracked out. Of course, we have a, a lot of special cards that are in packs right now. Um, I'll put the link again to that pack. The list of cards that are in packs in the description so you can see those. I just think they're going to read up these SBCs because they know how many special cards are in packs right now. And I don't think they're just willing to let people either have that much fun or be able to pack those high rated cards just like this. Um, because if they did, the 84 to 90, 85 to 92 required two sets of squads with, um, I think seven rare gold players, I believe both, both those, those upgrades were two different squads you had to fill out. Uh, it's basically, if you take the 81 double plus like this SBC that you have to do for an 81 double upgrade and do two of them, right? You have to have 11 rare gold players, 50 chemistry. You have to do two of those squads for an 84 double. And then, you know, what you have to do for the 82 to 88, uh, you have, I think to have seven rare gold players or seven gold players. Team Chemistry 45, so you would have to do two of these squads to get an 85 to 92 SBC. Same requirements as last time is what I would expect. I have a glimmer of hope for those SBCs. I'm not super duper sure that they're actually going to be coming out today on foot, but there is going to be some sort of SBC that is released, I think, in terms of upgrades. I do think we'll see the Icon Moments pack, and I hope, and I hope that we, I mean, Sunday could be a pretty big day of content. If they release two more of these UCL showdowns, which is not guaranteed, but it's possible, they re-release an icon upgrade for the moments. They re-release the upgrade packs, possibly the 8592, possibly the double 84. That would be sick. And then again, if we get the 85 or the 89 five rare players pack, that'd be dope. Alongside of the 92 plus Tots SF player pack as well. If all of those came out today, or even a couple of those, it could be a pretty hype Sunday in terms of content on this game of FIFA Ultimate Team. So, um, that's kind of all that we have to talk about today, boys. It honestly is. It's a little bit of a shorter video because there's just not that much to talk about. In terms of the market stuff, I really don't know if there's a lot of weekend league selling going on at the moment right now just because uh, it is August. You know, if there is an Icon Moments SBC that comes out, could that crash the market a little bit? 
yes, there's a possibility you would see some prices go down because uh, of people maybe selling a few icons because they feel like the icon moments would be packed, but mostly just because they need to sell cards to sell items they have in their club to be able to complete that SBC if it were to come out. And again, uh, I'll take a guess at this. If it does come out, probably like an, it might be the same requirements as the old icon upgrade, maybe a little bit more. So maybe an 87, 88 rated squad, maybe an 88 and an 89, maybe just an 86 and 88 again. We'll see, right? EA can do whatever they want with this SBC um, and whatever they want to try to drain more coins off this game. So if it is more expensive, I still feel like a lot of people want to do it and you'll still see people selling cards um, right now on this game to go and do those SBCs. So just watch out for some of that on the Sunday, two day inside of the market on FIFA Ultimate Team. If you enjoyed this video and if you're hyped for more Champions League content and upgrade SBCs, smash a thumbs up on it, comment down below if you have any questions, and of course, subscribe to the channel if you are new. It's been Nate, the Foot Accountant. Catch you guys later. Peace out.